What's up, YouTube? It's Yu-Gi-Oh! Nerds 3, and I got a knife. I'm gonna kill you guys. Stab you all. Just kidding here. I don't care. That was just a joke. Well, I got some new things I picked up. Picked up two decks. Goes first dead. One gateway and uh, one lost sanctuary. Don't worry, they were sealed before. I just kept them off to make sure that they were, okay? Look really weird because this was the old thing that they used to have at the one point that I changed after, like, two or three decks. Started with this opening. This, I'll leave this one for the next video, probably. Oh yeah, and this is showing those two decks. I'm gonna probably have after I'm done after you see these up. I'm probably gonna show you my next deck for the format that I'm probably gonna using. I usually keep my decks together and everything. Let's start. Out. There's this is the deck I get. This side, yeah, five D's rule book. Not bad. Box sanctuary deck list. And some uh, packs you can get to. And finally, it's the deck sound time. It's pretty friggin' nice, in my opinion. Let's zoom into this for a bit. Sorry about the glare there, but it looks really nice. Here's a 40 card deck, uh, where did I put that bloody knife? I'm not fiddling this time around with the deck. <clears throat> oh yeah, to be honest, I didn't get for the Hyperion or any of the hollows. I got for some just random crap in these decks. I know you're gonna laugh when you see who I got it for. Okay, I'll tell you what I got it for. Okay, this deck comes with an ultra rare Hyperion, super rare agent of Earth, a super rare agent of Jupiter, Saturn, that's pretty cool, I remember that from years ago, agent of Mercury, agent of Venus, agent of Force of Mars. Shine Ball, Splendid Venus, Splendid Penis, more like it, Goddess of Light, Victoria, that's pretty cool, Athena, this is what I got the deck for right here, Marshmallow, and I know that's just trolling, but I don't have that card yet, and I need it for a while, lovely card, it's a good card, okay, I'll, Heratris, Shining Angels, you need uh, this card, I always can use that for a staple. Soul of Light and Purity. Air Knight Power Shaft, I got that for the part of the deck. Nova Summoner. Zoraros, Herald Heaven, I got that for that. Honest. Hannah Wanta. Consecrated Light, that's why, I, yep. So those are monster cards. The magic cards or spell cards. Cards from the sky. But all in the hall of the fallen, terraforming, smashing ground, sanctuary in the sky, sanct times two, celestial transformation, burial from a different dimension, mausoleum and amporium, solidarity, uh, fountain in the sky, and there's that. The divine punishment, return from a different dimension. It's amazing. Torrential tribute, good. Beckoning of Light, uh, Miraculous uh, Descent, it's pretty cool, times two, and Solemn Judgment, I also love this card right here. So basically it's good if you just get it for the staples, but also the hollow helps also, it's good. These are basically the staples you get from this deck, that I can use anytime. And just a cool video, oh yeah, this is the first ed pack, just to tell you guys, just in case you guys didn't know. Come up first time most of the time, so you guys like to know that. And yeah, these were at Walmart for twelve bucks, so it's expensive like hell in Canada. But who cares? I'm probably not gonna end up getting the tins because they're just that crappy of promos. I'll probably get the what's it called, the Heretic tin. But that's about it. If you guys love the video. Yu-Gi-Oh Nerds three year signing out.